the brakes. There is a car coming, but that was completely safe. Wow, now here we go. This is it. We are out on the road in a full self-driving supervised Tesla Model 3. It's actually bizarre how human it feels. That might sound like a strange thing to say, but I assumed it would have be full of glitches and strange things that make it feel like a computer is steering the car, but it's it's like it's been trained by a human, and I suppose to an extent that's what has happened. Oh look, there's another autonomous Tesla going in the opposite direction. It can't spot little things like potholes, and a couple of times I would have oh, there's one right there. So that's probably the only sort of niggly detail I would say that stopping this car from being perfect. Oh, but for some reason we're just slowing down here. I don't know why. Um, it has suddenly. I'm gonna have to override. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so it ain't perfect. Now, whether you think this technology is deeply flawed and has a long way to go, because frankly, I think that's probably true, or whether you're one of the early adopters, which Tesla typically attracts, and you're all for this kind of technology, and you'd love to have an autonomous or self-driving car, it proves a massive step forward in self-driving driver assistance systems uh, and that no one is taking their foot off the gas when it comes to autonomous cars, self-driving technology.